Hey everyone, welcome back. Thank you very much for joining me on the channel today. As always, it's great to come back at you all with a brand new release. Of course, big up to all of you guys that are supporting over on the FYM Patreon. If you want to come over and support, you come to patreon.com forward slash FYM Productions Media. Now, this was a little bit of a surprise. We have got a brand new release from Linkin Park. This track is called Lost. Now, as far as I'm aware, it's due to the 20th anniversary of the album Meteora. Absolute banger album from back in the day, and I believe this is previously unreleased. So, from knowing exactly what it was like when we had Chester's passing, I'd imagine this one is going to hit pretty damned hard, because you guys will know what it's like to revisit those, those well, pretty much any Linkin Park track after we lost him and it just carries so much more meaning so i'm looking forward to seeing what this one does bring of course i'd imagine the majority of you are already subscribed to linkin park <laughs> of course if you're not do go and drop them a sub always has to be said regardless to how small or how big the band is but i'm looking forward to checking this out so let's just dive straight into this i believe it's an animation video i've not read anything into it not read any comments or anything like that so i don't really know what it's going to bring but i'm looking forward to jumping on a bunch of my friends who have featured it so i'm looking forward to checking this out today let's jump in guys this is linkin park and this is lost here we go I miss this sound. Just a scar mm. somewhere down inside of me. Something I cannot repair, even though it will always be. I pretend. I can't believe I'm here in Chester right now. There's so much more than like a B-side one. I'm absolutely loving this. Oh. It just hits so much harder because in the sun, man. Rest in peace, man. <sighs> All right, guys, so that was Linkin Park with Lost. 
I had a feeling the way that this was going to go, and this was exactly as it was. This track is just it. We're, we're, I just I just feel so, so lucky that the boys were able to bring us something else with Chesterman, especially back from the days of Meteora. Between the um between the debut man and the and the second album Meteora, um they 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 did a they did an awful lot for so for so many people. Just with the, the music alone from back then, um if it wasn't for that band, there'd be there'd be so many bands that that don't exist today. And unfortunately, as you will all know, we 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 did lose Chester and you just listen to those lyrics, man, and it was it was telling us all along. We knew we knew he wasn't okay, and he told us he told us, man. But I, I think the one thing that can come from, from the loss that the world had when he went, is the fact that I know now so many more people do talk about this sort of thing, and I do always feel a little bit strange about saying this sort of thing because it's obviously not something which I do personally struggle with but to anyone out there that is struggling you know whether it's a whether it's a family close friend whoever you need to reach out to man just just do it but this song was just absolutely fantastic for me it was just great to have something back from the days of meteora and to have this today it's funny you would think that something which was obviously recorded a hell of a long time ago wouldn't really stand up in the current scene and it really really does and it really saddens me that we'll never get to hear this live properly because it would have been amazing to uh to have seen this one live but let's face it it's linking part composition of a whole as a whole is obviously it's it's just perfect man it's classic linkin park it's beautifully true true lyrics it's chester baron his soul to us all man like he always did but just like it took us it took us losing him i think to really take additional value from the music which they put out not because we didn't appreciate it for how good it was i don't think we properly sort of looked into the lyrics you know we just saw him as oh it was like it's another banger from linkin park whereas now i do believe that we look back on these songs and we listen to them in a whole a whole different light you know You've all seen that the final concert that they did with Chester before he went, man, and he was just saying goodbye to everyone, and it and it's so sad, it's so sad to watch. I can remember, I can remember listening to those first two albums because those were like my favourites from them. After he went, and it it just hits so differently, it really, really does. I'm sure you have, but if you haven't had the opportunity to go back and re-listen to those first two albums, please do, because. They carry so much more meaning now. They really, really do. Of course, I absolutely love this one. I had a feeling it was going to be an emotional one, which it was. Love that they did an animation for this because it kind of, kind of brought Chester back to life again for us. Which is, you know, it's unfortunate that unfortunately that can't happen for real because he was, he was an absolute legendary vocalist. I know so many people looked up to him and just goes to show, man. Just because someone's smiling on the outside doesn't mean that's how it is inside. But thank you very, very much for watching. It was an absolute pleasure to feature this today. Hope you all did enjoy it as much as I did. Do please let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. But as always, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you all in the next one, and I'll catch you soon. Cheers. I love you.